Good evening and welcome to Compline for the Feast of St Luke the Evangelist on behalf of St Mary's Church Peterborough with Stuart and Elizabeth. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. All praise to you, O God, this night, for all the blessings of the light. Keep us, we pray, O King of kings, beneath your own almighty wings. Forgive us, Lord, through Christ your Son, whatever wrong this day we've done. Your peace give to the world, O Lord, that we might live in one accord. Enlighten us, O blessed light, and give us rest throughout this night. O strengthen us, that for your sake we all may serve you when we wake. And now Psalm 103. Bless the Lord, O my soul. And all that is within me, bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul. And forget not all his benefits. Who forgives all your sins. And heals all your infirmities. Who redeems your life from the pit. And crowns you with faithful love and compassion who satisfies you with good things, so that your youth is renewed like an eagle's. The Lord executes righteousness and judgment for all who are oppressed. He made his ways known to Moses and his works to the children of Israel. The Lord is full of compassion and mercy, slow to anger and of great kindness. He will not always accuse us, neither will he keep his anger for ever. He has not dealt with us according to our sins, nor rewarded us according to our wickedness. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is his mercy upon those who fear him. As far as the east is from the west, so far has he set our sins from us. As a father has compassion on his children, so is the Lord merciful to those who fear him. For he knows of what we are made. He remembers that we are but dust. Our days are but as grass. We flourish as a flower of the field. For as soon as the wind goes over it, it is gone. And its place shall know it no more. But the merciful goodness of the Lord is from old, and he endures for ever on those who fear him. And his righteousness on children's children. On those who keep his covenant. And remember his commandments to do them. The Lord has established his throne in heaven. And his kingdom has dominion over all. Bless the Lord, you angels of his. You mighty ones, who do his bidding, and hearken to the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all you his hosts. You ministers of his, who do his will. Bless the Lord, all you works of his, in all places of his dominion. Bless the Lord, O my soul. And Psalm 134. Come. Bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord. You that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary. And bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth. 
give you blessing out of Zion. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. A reading from Ephesians 2, verses 19 to 21. You are no longer strangers and aliens, but you are citizens with the saints and also members of the household of God, built upon the foundation of the apostles and prophets, with Christ Jesus himself as the cornerstone. In him the whole structure is joined together and grows into a holy temple in the Lord. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Some intercessions. In joy and hope we pray. We pray to the Father. Hear our prayer. That our risen Saviour may fill us with the joy of his gracious and life-giving resurrection. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our, our prayer, prayer, that isolated and persecuted churches may find fresh strength in the good news of Easter. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our, our prayer, that God may grant us humility to be subject to one another in Christian love. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our prayer, prayer, that he may provide for those who lack food, work or shelter. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our prayer, prayer, that by his power, war and famine may cease through all the world. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our prayer, prayer that he may reveal the light of his presence to the sick, the weak and the dying, to comfort and strengthen them. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our prayer, prayer, that he may send the fire of the Holy Spirit upon his people, so that we may bear faithful witness to his resurrection. We pray to the Father, hear, hear our prayer. prayer. And the collect for the 19th Sunday after Trinity. Faithful Lord, whose steadfast love never ceases and whose mercies never come to an end, grant us the grace to trust you and to receive the gifts of your love new every morning. In Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Almighty God, you called Luke the physician whose praise is in the gospel, to be an evangelist and physician of the soul, by the grace of the Spirit and through the wholeness 
wholesome medicine of the gospel. Give your church the same love and power to heal through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace. And may your blessing be always upon us, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. And as our Saviour taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus. For the night is at hand, and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Amen.